Hey, my YouTuber friends. We made it out to the Missouri River for the three-day weekend, Labor Day weekend, and uh, we're all set up to do some catfishing. Got some shrimp out on a little three-way rig sitting on bottom, and uh, we're going to see if we can catch some catfish perfect size for dinner. I ain't looked for no giants yet. Got some bigger bait to put on later, and uh, see if we can catch some skipjack, too, in between. Get some big cut bait for later tonight. So let's see what we can catch this weekend. Thanks for watching. Make sure you hit subscribe. So this bull here, it's got the heavy weight. It's out in the deep current. We missed the last fish, but it just got whacked pretty good. And then this guy here, I've had the small ones messing with it. It's kind of back here in this little, we're just in a cut. It's a nice shaded area. It's 15 foot deep right here. It's like six foot deep right off the back of the boat and we're uh we're pulled into shore right here but one of these little ones is going to get out of the way for a big one eventually I just keep whacking it but not not getting it in their mouth i'm thinking they're just smalls but this guy here it's in the current with the eight ounce weight whatever's going to hit that it's got a big piece of bait too whatever hits that it's going to be big all right, we got a big taker on that. The rod that's out in the deep water. He wants it. Give him a little bit of slack. Just kind of let the rod down a little bit. Let him have a little bit. Cause that's got that heavy weight. There you go. He wants it. I might might even be on. I just don't know if he's on it yet or not. Once he's on it, we're gonna know it'll bend over double. I'm gonna get the GoPro up here and get some action. We've missed two fish on here, so we're gonna let them take it a little bit longer. It's a big chunk of fish on there too, so. Yeah. There we go. It's bouncing yeah. in the current right now. Grab the pole, bow down to it just a little bit so we can have a little bit of slack. Okay. That's a good leash on. See, he's pulling against that eight ounce weight right now also. Make sure. Yeah. All right. Do you feel it still? Yeah, it's just current. Just current? He'll come back. There he is. Think got, you him. got him this time? Got him. All right. Think. Come on. That weight's so dang heavy. I think the fish are fighting the weight a little bit. I think you're on my other line too. Yeah. Maybe, maybe not. What do we got? Oh, we got a fish. Got a, got a fish. Flop him on in. Well, let me net him so we don't lose him. Yeah. Seems a lot bigger when he's fighting. <laughs> that big old that's eight ounce nice weight cat, there. Though. That's dinner. Yeah, that's a good dinner sized cat right there. Nothing too big, nothing too small. That big old weight sometimes can't tell when you got a smaller fish. There we go. Nice, nice. Oh. All right. It's just lucky I managed to hook him. <laughs> yeah, he actually got him this time. Sucker. All right, there we go. Yeah. Happy day. Well, it's Saturday morning, and, uh, Here's our Missouri River camp set up. This nice little cove back here. Situated right behind this little wing dam here. They use those to control the uh, flow of the water here on the Missouri. And you can see on the other side of the river is riprap. They got this river throttled down pretty good to a pretty deep 
pretty steady, pretty fast flowing channel out in the the whole river is pretty much the channel. They don't whip back and forth like your normal rivers do, like the Mississippi does. So there's the tent. All my camp gear set up for cooking and uh, food and I got the chainsaw out brought it this trip so done some sawing on some wood there's plenty of wood back there and uh, that's where I've been chilling this morning hanging out in my chair I got my poles down here set up and uh, that's for remains of our fire from last night gonna be a good another another good fire night tonight it's just a perfect cloudy day for fishing it's supposed to get a little bit of rain 20 percent chance possibly so and it's looking like it's gonna rain sometime but here's the poles gotta walk through a little water to get there Beautiful day to be on the Missouri. Beautiful weekend to be on Missouri. Labor Day weekend 2021. Thanks for watching and make sure you hit subscribe. Let's see if we can get some fish on here today. Got a couple last night. I'm gonna break them out later and get them flayed up. It was just too dark to uh, get anything on film. There it is, one of them. It's a big old channel cat. get the other one out of here. Well, what is it was not as big as I thought it was. But yes, right on actually. I'm right at it. I thought it was 12 pounds. We're 11.94. That's a pretty damn nice cat right there. Pretty nice. That's a big channel cat. You know, state record's huge, but uh for average channel cat size, you don't get many 12 pounders. Yep. Pretty nice fish. Middle of the night last night, the bell woke us up on the back of the boat. It pulled drag and pulled drag and fought and fought. It was a heck of a fight in the middle of the night, all tired, just crawling out of bed. All right, I'm gonna get the weight on the, uh, the little blue cat next. Well, here's the blue cat from last night before we went to bed. But uh, it was so dark, there wasn't getting any, getting any footage, so. I guess it's just right too. I said seven pounds when we caught her and sure enough, she's right at seven pounds. Seven pounds, 7.09, so pretty good guess. Nice little blue, nice little blue. It's gonna be good eating right there. We're gonna have that for lunch here in a few minutes. This guy literally jumped in the front of the boat last night. So I just tied him on a little stringer on the side of the boat. And uh, I'm gonna cut him up and see how he does for some cut bait. Everybody says silver carp is uh, good enough for bait, I guess. Some people say it's good enough to eat, but uh, I got a couple nice catfish, so we're not gonna bother eating this sucker. But yeah, jumped right in the front of the boat, went to flopping around when we pulled into the cove. Had it happen last year too. Pretty crazy. Hey, hey, got a nice little eater sized cat. Middle of the day, the hour of suck, according to Catfish Dave. <laughs> but uh, got one in the little ditty line. Just simple hook, simple weight, piece of cut bait, tie it off to the tree. Well, we got a little ditty line tied back here. I'm pretty sure it's got a fish on it again. Oh yeah, it's got a fish for sure. Let's see what we got. Oh, another perfect eating size fish. Look at that. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. 
Yeah, right in the middle of the day. So we're gonna anchor up here and do some casting too. We just got a couple of these lines out just for kicks. And uh, they're producing, that's two fish. They're this size off this line within about two hours in the mid afternoon. All right. Happy Missouri River Day. Huh? Here's the camp spot. Got the fire rolling. Robbie's over there cooking dinner. Got the tent. The boat's back there in the darkness. And there's the river. Got a couple poles set up there. And we're ready to catch some cats tonight. Caught a couple nice ones last night. Hopefully, we can have a repeat tonight. Another morning on the Missouri. There's the beautiful sunrise. Fog on the water and uh, it's seven o'clock. Kind of late actually. Yeah, this one's got a fish on it for sure. Yeah. Just a little guy though. Just a little guy. Wasting my bait. Bait this sucker. Looks like we'll get two or three fish on it this morning. Man, tough skin. All right, simple as that. Off to the next ones. <coughs> that old silver carp cut bait. Worked good. Works good. Last one. Let's 
see if there's anything on her. Might be, I don't know. Looks kind of lively. Oh, she's moving around. There's fish. I'll be dang. Dang. Night of the small fish. He's a mess too, dang it. <laughs> there we go. She's a little guy. Get this line off here, pull it in. There we go. Yeah, I got one taking it pretty good. Messed with a few minutes ago and he went away for a minute. Now he's back. Let him have some slack so we can have that sucker. This one's got chunk of shrimp on it with a little bit of cut bait. going on right now he's coming up and grabbing it coming up and grabbing it coming up and grabbing it he's not committing it's either a really small one that can't get it in his mouth or it's a big one just testing the water testing it I got him got him good fish good fish Good fish. Get him up out of that debris that other one got into. Good fish. I'm guessing he's 10 plus pound fish. The way he feels, good fish. All right. A couple hours this morning. Yeah. Oh yeah, good fish. Loosen that drag up a little bit too. Ooh. Watch get on the boat. What we got here? Oh no, he's no 10 pounder. He's just a fighter. A little flathead. Ah, he's just a heck of a fighter. No giant. A little flathead on cut bait of all the things, huh? little fish Let this little guy go back and grow up. Yeah, rare catch for cut bait. Like that shrimp, like the shrimp. Oh, hey there, all my YouTuber friends. Coming down to the end of the fishing trip here on the Missouri River for the weekend. Come out Friday night and stayed uh, through Saturday night and a Sunday morning now about, about 10.30. I think I'm gonna call it quits here pretty soon. It's getting hot. And about time to go get camp picked up and head on back to town. Thanks for watching. Make sure you hit subscribe. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to hit subscribe. Almost to 100 right now. A long ways to go to that thousand, but I like to see the hundred. Have a good day.